Hello there guys, it's me and Stable Voltage. Welcome back to episode 7 of Civilization 6 as Kublai Khan. And I've got this city that keeps flipping, which is a little bit annoying. I'm hoping I can get us out of that mess a little bit by uh, growing the city. 325 turns until rebellion. It looks like we might have actually sorted that one out now. The population is still stagnating, which is not good. Uh, let's make sure we are working... Uh, I guess actually there's no point working the, the ones that are mostly food because the the um, population is not growing anyway. So we may as well build other buildings. Uh, so let's start getting some more stuff over here. Uh, an entertainment complex might actually be useful. Let's go ahead and put it down here and then it'll reach all of these cities. Uh, repair the water mill. So yeah, I don't think we are going to be going to war straight away. I'm going to back up a little bit with some of these units. We'll keep some units around just in case uh, anything looks like it might happen. He's probably going to get upset that we've got units close to his borders, so we'll back up a little bit. Not that I care if he, if he does, really, but we'll back up with those units. In fact, I should try and put units into uh, all cities where possible. Okay, there we go. There's the Sanguine Pact. These are the ones that I want. We can't get them right now. Can't appoint them. So we'll do that next time. So as well as being able to recruit vampires, which are really nice units, they are essentially um, melee units that gain combat strength every time they kill another unit. And they are mostly indestructible as well. They don't, they don't die. They just kind of retreat off with minimal health. So that's a really, really nice uh, perk. Uh, but as you unlock more governor titles for the Sanguine Patch, you can actually build these uh, unique tile improvements that clone all of the yields of the six tiles around them. So you can end up with some really, really good tiles. Definitely worth doing, especially when you've got um, ridiculously over overpowered wonders like the one um, that we have up here. I mean, when you consider when you consider the yields of some of these tiles, I mean, if I if I was to put, um, depends which tiles I actually get, but if I was to build one of those uh, unique buildings here, it would clone all the yields of the six tiles around it, including these two. Um, so, yeah, it's definitely worth uh, looking into that. Um, trade route plundered. Oh, well, that wasn't nice. We've lost a trade route now. Another tech boost, discovered a new continent, wonder completed. Dedication bonus triggered. Okay, University Art Block. Let's get the lighthouse. So many things to build and so little time. Let's move you up to there. You can move into that city. You're going to move into Panama. Just trying to make sure that we've got a unit in every city for the purposes of uh, garrison. Um, we definitely want to keep at least one unit down here. So I think we're going to move you up to there and you're going to stay here just as a guard. We'll keep that catapult around should we need it. Um, Loyalty is going up here now, yet, yeah, so we should be fine here. Uh, we have ourselves a builder. What are we going to do with you? Oh, that's that one that we got for free. Only has one build left. Let's go and get the dies, actually. Need those. And time to start exploring. There's China. Well, we already know where China is anyway, but we need to find the others. And we find Gandhi. Mohandas Gandhi hoon. Mere log mujhe Bapu kehte hain. Par kripya, mujhe mitra kehen. Nice to meet you. And where are you? You're up here somewhere. There you are. Excellent. Let's keep working our way around. Gandhi doesn't dislike us. We've got plenty of money. Let's send him a delegation. Will he be friend? No, he won't enter and he won't be a friend. That is a shame. And he's ha he likes China and he likes Spain. Okay, maybe he will, he will get friendly with us. We'll have to see there. Uh, governor established that is fine. Now, why is our population stagnating? We've got housing. If we go a little bit off this and go for food now. Yes, we can once again grow. So let's go for the food tiles. Yeah, still same population stagnating. Um, 
disloyal, minus 75%, but the loyalty is going up. Poor loyalty in 71 turns. So as that loyalty goes up, things will be better. So as it's going to stagnate, we might as well just keep um, people on the production tiles. We still might end up having to go to war with Grand Columbia because if it does stagnate, then it won't um, it won't put any pressure out. So let's go ahead and get rid of that unit there because you're about to pillage one of my other trade routes. So I need to build another trader. Yep, delegation from Gandhi's basically sending me the money back that I just sent to him. There we go. Starting to grow now. Full loyalty in 44 turns. Volcano becomes dormant. It's not mine. There's a storm somewhere. Not too much of a problem for me. Uh, let's go this way. Choose a production. What do we want over here? You don't have any fresh water, do you? Let's get an aqueduct in here. Um, let's get that one. Because we can save this for like a campus or something. Temple, granary, ancient walls. I mean, the granary is not that useful because we're not really growing. So let's get a temple for now. We can send an envoy. Let's try working on Venice. Yep, you're going to stay there. And we've met another hero. This is Beowulf. Ignores movement penalties in hills. Um, target, in an ancient, uh, target an adjacent enemy unit with combat strength less than Beowulf's. Beowulf immediately destroys the target, plus one charge and one movement. Interesting. So we've met Brussels now as well. I might just put that guy on, on auto explore. I know there are a lot of, a lot of barbarians around. Um, there is only one leader now that we haven't met. Yep, one leader. Uh, what's our science per turn like? So we've got, we're in third place. We've got more science than Grand Columbia. China's ahead of us. Uh, only by five techs. We're not bothered about religious victories or anything. I think we might be okay. We'll, we'll have a look. We need a unit in this city. We'll probably build one after the campus, actually. Just so that it has a unit sat in there. Hero discovered. I don't think I need to build any more units as of right now. Renaissance era, so some more era bank. score. Said hour bank. There's banking done. Um, cartography. Gold from fishing boat improvements. That can be useful. It's got two harbours, so we might as well. Can't do anything else with uh, Mulan now. She is basically spent. Only got two lifespan remaining. Yeah, you are going to go on to automated exploration. Let's just get rid of all the spam. On to the next turn. Gandhi does not like me. He's unfriendly. Why are you unfriendly? Seems a little harsh, but all right. Would you be willing to buy some stuff? Why can't I can't even click that. There we go. Would you give me more than that? No. I guess it's better than nothing. I mean, I've got a lot of the lot of the cocoa, so let's sell some stuff to him. Choose production. We need to get a. Right, I'm going to build the workshop, and I'm just going to straight up buy a trader. As we lost one. Uh, yes, let, now I did say I wanted a military unit here, but again, I've got plenty of money. So we could just go ahead and buy one. Um, we could get uh, well, unit unit, actually. Let's do that, because it'll give us some, some era score. I don't think we're going to get to a golden age. Uh, there's the skirmisher. I'm going to put you on automated explorer as well. Probably a bad idea. Probably die very soon. And there we go. That'll be Mulan finished at the end of this turn. 
There we go. So we do get, uh, or we should get, yep, there we go. We get the great work for that. So there's a trader. Okay, so where are we going to move you to? No city-state quests. Can't reach China yet, which is weird, even though we have a harbour. So let's go to Hunza. Um, you can stay there. And yes, we want to get that. That will actually help with the amenities. There's another one there, but we can't really reach. There's just one there as well. We just can't really reach them. Just having a look and wondering if it's worth Because there's another one there as well. So we could potentially... Um, get another monopoly if we grab some of those we do have one down here oh we already had one but it's not improved how much money have we got enough money to don't want to click on that enough money to buy another builder and upgrade some stuff around here full loyalty in 19 turns that's actually speeding up quite quickly now not really a lot we could do on that turn uh, you want to swap these epics you want open, but yeah, it's just not worth my time. Sorry. Need to find that last civilization. It might be somebody that we can trade with. 14 turns. Is it worth trying to get this to grow? Yeah, there's there's still what's what's the penalty? Wavering loyalty negative twenty five. It still shouldn't be that bad. Maybe it'll pick up on the next turn. Improve that. Yeah, see so dies. Have the opportunity to I should look at that actually in more detail and find out how it works. There's diplomatic problems. service from let's go and sort that out first of all. Um, we're not building spies yet. Trade route to an ally city. We don't have any allies. I'm not worried about that. So, no, we'll leave that as it is for now. Uh, trader capacity increased. Excellent. Not even sure where we want to get that last trader. What I did want to have a, a quick look at, though, was... Um, I forget that F1 brings that up now. It used to be this. So, Monopolies, how exactly... First Luxury Resource, Monopoly... Industries, Monopolies and Corporations. There we go. So you enjoy your luxuries and maybe it's time to mobilise them for profit. The Monopolies and Corporations mode enables you to build industries around your luxury resources which give particular bonuses depending on the resources. Found corporations to improve those yields, manufacture unique product brands that act as economic great works and finally secure a monopoly um once civilization has improved two of the same type of luxury and has completed the currency technology they have the opportunity to establish an industry around the resource resources owned by city states also count towards this requirement if the player is the citizen of the city state this is done by using a builder's charge on top of existing improvement of any one of the luxury resources only one industry is allowed in the city at the time in addition to providing great merchant points, industry get particular bonuses to the city based on the type of resource they get. So the Cocoa gives us growth and plus three housing. Dyes will give us faith yield. Not amazing, is it? And then the other things come a little bit later. So it's probably worth doing. Maybe. Possibly. Just about. So if we do that, you'll give us some more faith choose a civic we're probably not going to well we probably will get two temples at some point um you don't need an aqueduct let's go ahead and get that university how are things going with religion here this is um zoroastrianism is still the dominant religion even though buddhism does exist only three Buddhism citizens and I cannot produce um, yeah I cannot produce one of my own units that's a real shame 
Amenities are still terrible in general. Does anybody have anything I can trade for? Let's establish an embassy. Oh, you don't want to, you don't even want an embassy. That is harsh. Um, you don't have anything that I want. China embassy. Yeah, you'll have an embassy. Um, that will be blocked. Yeah. Scientific Alliance. Do not accept. Oh, come on. I have an embassy with Spain. Yeah, he'll accept. And you don't have anything I need either. I just can't get a good deal going here, can I? I mean, I guess I could trade with Grand Columbia if I don't intend to wipe them out. Met a new city-state, new city-state quest. We get a farm over there. Probably should get a farm there. Can I trade with you? See, you don't have anything I need either. There is just nothing useful. Need a workshop and a university. Let's get the university first, I think. Yeah, now don't you get going too close to those barbarians. Not in all who wander. Are There's lost. cartography done. I love that Geneva are trying to take out three quadrimes with a knight. Friendship has expired with Spain. I think we can get that back. No. He does not accept. Although he's friendly and we have no grievances. This is very weird. Uh, let's get astronomy going. Let's go and improve that. So we're about one turn away from growth here. So yeah, this city I think has finally sorted itself out. There is no shame in deterrence. Having a weapon is very different from actually using it. I like how we speak English now, but he doesn't when you first meet him. He learns quick. Uh, you want a deal from me. You refused friendship. You can't you can't refuse friendship and then come like crawling to me for a deal. Not how this works. Yeah, amenities are a big problem right now. I mean we could oh commercial hubs. We also don't have a government plaza, we should probably get one. Let's go put one in there. We can delay that too long. We're already at turn one hundred and sixty. Barbarians, of course. It's a skirmisher. This probably means there's a barbarian camp up here, so we'll go and have a look at that in a minute. Discovered another continent. Too many pop ups. Make a dedication. New speciality districts. Not going to do the religion one. Continents, we've discovered them all anyway. Um, we are going to get more and more trade routes. So, reform the coinage might be useful for us. Speaking of trade routes, let's just go and buy that trader. Always worth buying them if you can afford it because they do pay for themselves quite quickly. Listen. Strange women. There's lie. divine right. Gives us a new government type. We actually got monarchy now. So that's three era score straight off. We're not really building units. We have maintenance reduction. Let's put that there as well. Although we probably don't need that anymore, but we'll leave it for a little while. And um Let's get some great scientist points coming in. That's castles boosted. Right, four trade routes. We can't have four, we can only have three, but we will get there soon. Have six cities following your religion. That's not going to happen anytime soon, so we're not going to get a boost for that. One turn for the ancient walls. So let's just go and get it done now. We do have a governor title. I do want the Sanguine Patch, but we're not at war. So I'm going to start promoting Liang. 
uh, and I'm going to go for Zoning Commissioner because we do want to get reinforced materials as soon as possible. And then the... Is that volcano still active? It is, yeah. So, trade route. I guess Venice is a decent trade route for now. Really need to extend the range of these trade routes. Need to find where that barbarian camp is. Well, that might be it right there. Is much more fun when you're not an astronomer. Right, that's that done. Let's move you back a little. Got a promotion available there. I'm just going to send in some backup. Castles is only three turns. Might as well get that done. Right, audience chamber. Amenities and three housing to cities with governors. But minus two loyalty in cities without governors. It's still probably the best one for us, though. Um, 11 gold if we go to China there. We can reach China now. Yay! That gives us a boost. A boost to military tactics and a boost to medieval fairs. When that finishes, we'll go to one of their other cities and see what happens. Uh, unit promotion available. Um... I'm not going to give the, them the promotion yet. I'm just going to back them up towards the city. Uh, great scientist. Gain 250 science for each adjacent mountain tile. That is good because there's at least one spot somewhere that is sur almost surrounded by mountain tiles. Um, I can't get them into this spot, unfortunately. That would be a great spot. Um... This one would be one, two, three, four. I was looking to see if there was one that might have five. Four's decent. Anything less than four, it's probably not worth bothering. But yeah, fa five mountain tiles is, is good. Well, five mountain tiles would be great, but four is good. So where do we want to send you to? Probably this spot. Just having a quick look around just to see if there's there's one that I've missed. Yeah, I don't think there's a better one. Sometimes you do find like one little open tile that you can get into that's surrounded by mountains. But I'm not seeing any of those. Okay. Uh, the city growing even more. Friendship has expired. Now that's the friendship with China. Can we get that back? Gandhi's actually friendly with me now. Right, so China will be friendly. Spain will now randomly be friendly for no particular reason. Gandhi will now have an embassy. Andy accepts friendship. What's going on? China. Research Alliance. Yes, there we go. Gandhi, Cultural Alliance. Oh, no, I don't want to declare war on you. That'd be bad. No, he won't do it. Um, Philip. I should probably wait, actually, and, and get a uh, economic alliance with China if we can send trade routes to them. Right, what's going on here? Yeah, you're sending units in. So, let's get there with the backup. Yeah, we don't want that. Just because we're friends now doesn't mean we'll be trading you all our great works. Rocks in my path. There's castles done. I'm going to wipe you out with the city just so that we can get this upgrade. That's it. Let's see if he moves a little bit closer. Research military tactics is only two turns. We don't have a campus here. We've got a plus three campus if we build it there. 
Because we are a little bit behind on signs. You have arrived. Tactics mean doing what you can. I should have queued some more stuff up, but that's fine. It doesn't matter anyway. Um, because everything's gonna be one turn. Mass production. Let's go on to the next turn. It's interesting to know what those barbarians are doing. So printing, we don't even have two universities yet. Might as well get gunpowder actually. Yeah, you have moved closer as expected. If he attacks me, he's just going to get himself destroyed, so that's fine. Let's get that granary. And there we go. That's all we can do on this turn. I think that's probably a good place to end the video, given how long we've been going. So thanks a lot for watching, guys. I hope you are still enjoying Civilization VI. Uh, if you have enjoyed the video, please do consider leaving a thumbs up. If you haven't, then do consider leaving a thumbs down. But I'd like to thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next video. And until then, goodbye for now.